All right, everybody. I am back. Uh, thank you all for joining us. We got Albert Luna at the table right now. Rules. It is supposed to be lag for the break. One, sorry, nine on the spot, one in the front, two in the back. They are breaking from the box, alternate break. They are no longer using the three-point rule. They're just going with no soft breaking. You gotta, you gotta crack it. Uh, three foul rule is in effect. The jump cues are allowed. All right, sorry, everyone. If someone was looking at cookies on the baking booth. All right. Albert's like a 681. Uh, Clint is like a 707, I believe. Albert snuck right through there. I don't know if he wanted to bump it. Mm, did he bump it enough? Well, I'm not sure if he wanted to make it. No, he definitely didn't want to make it. Sorry, I just looked at the re looked at the table. Let's come back out for the four. Bump it back. Is he going to get it back enough? Nah, he, <clears throat> he's still got to worry about that seven ball, which is on the left short rail. And he could bank it, bank the six, or try to and keep it over there. He can cut it. He's going to have to compensate for it. Oh, nice bank. Okay, so Albert gets on the board first. Let y'all watch him. He is putting nine on the spot. It's a little bit more interesting when you're using a Accurac or Templar Rack. These are Accurac. Alcaville is one of the channel sponsors, not channel sponsor, but tour sponsors. And 
The one in the front and two is in the back. Let's go back to the main view. All right, Albert to break. They are breaking from the box. And the box is one diamond out each from the center diamond and up to the head string. Okay. He's got a shot on the one. Two's down. He's right there by that three ball. He is kind of close to the rail, so stop shot's pretty much eliminated. But he's got plenty of angle there to be able to come off the long run, come back for the four. Or he'll just bump into it, which would work great. Hmm? Hey, how are you? I'm good. And with him bumping the four, he is kind of, it's not straight. He's got a little bit of an angle there. Make sure he lines up for the five. Because the six is over here by the bottom left, by the eight ball. And he's got to get back over for the seven on the other long. Don't, 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 don't. Oh, we lost it. Okay, so Clint's come to the table. We've got ball in hand. Three balls left on the table. Pop. Let me make sure I put the link in. Yes. I'm cheating. Okay, let me update the score behind on it.
All right. We're going to bank it. Hmm, let's try, but he did two way. But they fixed it. Huh? Huh? All right. Okay, you can't hear any music? Okay, but you can hear background cheering. All right, that'll work. And we've got it set right. Thank you, Zammer. Good, don't fuse out. Ball in hand. Oh, we got away from him. I mean, he can still cut it, but it rolled. Just going to play safe. Wow. It, that might be kickable. With where it is for the bottom uh, bottom corner pocket. <clears throat> oh, nice try. He didn't quite get it. Got back of the path. Oh, sec table two. Neil lost the cue ball in the side pocket. Gonna play safe. Okay, Clint's got ball in hand, five left on the table. Let's get back for it. Yeah, he can cut it, but it, it's not an easy one. Not as easy as he would prefer to have set it up. Doing more giveaways, door prizes for the players.
Got there on the eight. Okay, Clint goes up to one. All right, while we're waiting, let me show y'all. Lisa has been working with Heather from Brutal Game Gear. Uh, if you go to BrutalUSA.com and you look under the brand shops right there, hit backwards billiards you come to ours now lisa is work, working with heather about some more merchandise but lisa is actually wearing one of the jerseys right now that one right there uh, but they do come in other colors and lisa is actually working on some of the different designs but we've got the red and black we've got the white and black and gray and black. and i need to get you back to the table because albert's about to Yes, I did. How is everybody today? We've got 94 watching. We haven't had any movement in the chat for a little bit. I know there's a lot of stuff going on. We appreciate all y'all joining us. Tell me what y'all are drinking. What is y'all's drink of choice? Well, Albert tries to figure this out. Nice bank there from Albert. Accomplishment. See that three ball. Bump it. Nope. Looks like the seven will go by the nine after this four. Did he get up far enough? Look on his face, I'd say no. No, oh, the six was first. What the heck am I doing? 
Sorry, everyone. Let me around. He can make the nine. It'll be respotted. But did he set up enough of a shot? He's looking for the nine. There it is. All right. What's up? <laughs> Lisa's going through the bios right now that everyone filled out today. Some of them got some interesting accomplishments. Hey, Russell, welcome. Glad you made it back home. All right. Oh, nice shot, Albert. Okay. Now, we got a bio for Clint here. This he gave it to me. Uh, he's shooting with a Jeff Tucker. He also breaks with a Jeff Tucker and jumps with him. He's from Corning, Texas. Cargo's a, five o, a sorry, 705. <clears throat> His favorite size table is a 7-footer. Favorite game is 8-ball. He is sponsored by Bab Lending and Money Mo. His accomplishment. That he made it to the age he is. Nice. Very nice. Let me watch that. Yeah. Okay, Russell. Okay, back to the this here. We do have the jerseys in different colors. Now, if you go back, let's go back. We've got also t-shirts. These are some of the most comfortable t-shirts you will ever wear. And they can put the new logos on the uh, our original logo on the shirt as well. She's coming on. She's in charge of clothing. Yeah, because I'm over here talking to the screen. Um, anything, if you're on the website and you see it and you need uh, and you want our logo on it, Heather could probably put it on there, the, the, our regular logo, not the other logo. And if you see the 
uh, like a polo or something, she could probably do the, our logo on there as well. I am, like he said earlier, I am coming up with new stuff as well. Huh? They're in the car. Okay, get you back to the table. Uh, Lisa's been having fun designing stuff with Heather. They did go to Derby City together. I've got a lot more pictures and some videos coming up that I'm in the process of editing now. Uh, yes, we do have hats, Russell. Uh, matter of fact, we will be picking up hats from Heather next Saturday. She's going to be at Skinny Bob's at the uh, Nine Ball Classic. and We're going to drive up there Saturday and pick up the hat. Baby, Russell asked, got hats? I said yes. Okay, she's going to explain everything to you again. Yes, hats too. I, ha I will have hats here. Uh, I go pick them up. Saturday. Saturday. And I'll probably have them made, well, a little bit after that. Um, but yes, I have hats. Hey, Yap. How are you doing? Hi, Yap. <clears throat> Yes. <clears throat> Excuse me. Excuse me, sir. Of course they're good ones. You don't buy cheap stuff. You? Trust me, I know. Whatever. <laughs> <laughs> oh, nice little pop back over for the five. Hey, Jason, how you doing? Uh, anyone, if I've missed y'all in the chat when y'all commented, I do apologize. Okay, Albert's just going to give it to him. Russell, I have black ones. Well, that's the majority of what I'm going to get made. But I have a purple one. I think I have a lime green one. It's gray with lime green. I have a red one. It's all red. And blue, I think. Sounds good. So if there's a special color that you want, Russell, you just email me and let me know. Hmm. All right, buddy. I've got an empty glass of Coke. I'm going to go get me a refill. Be right back. Oh, shoot. That means i got to pay attention. <laughs> it's a really pretty green and gray. Well, well, well. How you doing, Spurs?
Oh shoot, I'm supposed to be paying attention. Just waking up. Well, good morning, sir. All right, I am back. Hey, Spurs 2K20. Spurs is just waking up. Spurs is just waking up. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm going to go get this to the ladies. Okay. That's the love tap on that five ball. I wish I was just waking up. Felt like I woke up like two days ago. Yeah, bar is still open. Albert might find a little bit of groove here. Shoot it. Uh, well, different cities have different parts of. Uh, they got Asian communities. Uh, Houston has one. San Antonio actually has two. It's where all the Asian markets are. Uh, we've got one on the east. We got on the east side, and we got them on the west side. Uh, Houston has a big kind of town. Went there years ago. Friends of mine went over there for acupunct uh, acupuncture and took us out to eat. Huge dim sum restaurant. Uh, he did not want that, so Albert just gave it right back to him on the push. Backwards, Gmail. All right, I think I got a bracket, everybody. Stacy. All right, they got the bracket of everyone done. I will get it pinned to the chat here in a moment.
Oh yeah, Lisa's Lisa's doing it. Well, she would be. You know, she is Hawaiian Chinese. Most people don't realize that with Lisa. All right, everybody. Uh, the the bracket is pinned to the top of the chat. Uh, it's the Chinese New Year. Okay, now uh, Clint's not going to make it shoot it. All right, and next month will be the second stop of the Predator Arcadia Syntex Pool Tour. We'll be at Skinny Bob. Up in Round Rock, March 2nd and 3rd. <laughs> oh, sorry to hear that, yep. Albert's just pushing out. Okay, Clint's at the table. I'm gonna take it in the side and try to break that five. No, actually, he didn't want to break it out. Two ball. He set up beautifully and went knock it eight. He'll roll up a little bit for the three. All right, Russell. Yeah, go sit down. Yeah, yeah, you can put them on. If you ain't shy. All right, everyone, we have another new victim in the booth. <laughs> hey everybody, how are y'all? We got uh, Rudy Sanchez. He was the one that won the first match on the stream. How you looked like you started off strong, then fell off a little bit, and then came back strong against the match. Yeah, the break is very favorable. Uh, for the box? For the box, I go on the spot, do it at the bottom. Yeah, I think break well. well, Matt has it figured out. 
Yeah, he was breaking from the left side. Yeah. Uh, I was breaking from the right side. He's got I'm it. a lefty, so he's a righty. So right. He's just, but he was getting that one ball in that side pocket or at least close. Yeah, and I started breaking. He, he was breaking from it on the right side. So kind of out a little bit. Uh, Jason says you have a seven ball. <laughs> what Jason? Yeah. Oh, I'm going for the three beat. I want the Acadia and then Lone Star. Yeah. Hello. All right. Can y'all hear him okay? Do I need to? I'm not sure. That's why, that's why I was going to ask them if they can hear you. Then you don't need to, but. And y'all can see here's this, where they're racking. Yep. It helps when you get two cameras. Right. Yeah, so it's nine on the spot and eight on the bottom. There's no three. No, they, they got they got rid of it. Yeah, they got rid of it. Uh, just no soft breaking. I was watching Buddy Hall how to break from the box here in my match. <laughs> I was like, I can't make a ball on the break, so I literally went on YouTube and started looking at a Buddy Hall video. And well, it worked I, out. I talked to Matthew after the last stop. He says, I just watched the pros break and did what they did. Right, you know, because right. bathroom, they got a break from the box. The nine's on the spot. So just watch what they're doing. <laughs> I'm oh. still playing. Yeah, I'm still playing real good. Being blind being and sick. retired, yeah, and retired. But he, he wasn't happy they held this match for the stream because he's been waiting to play. So, not that he was mad about it, but he just was like, "Hey, let's just play." Right. Oh, I, f I forgot to move it over. Did I? I forgot to move it over. I'm sorry, everyone. My bad. Y'all can fire me. I know I'm all looking at the nine ball. Yeah, it hasn't moved. <laughs> <laughs> so who does everybody like in the Super Bowl? Huh? Oh, my Super Bowl. My Super Bowl pick is I don't care. I gave up on the Super Bowl a long time ago for <clears throat> NFL. It may just be me. I'm loud. But I can tone myself down a little bit. It's going to be a good game. Yeah, it should be a good game. Go, go, game. Yeah, I, I gave up on the NFL when million dollar players can't get hit. You know, right? It's becoming like uh, NBA. Yeah, why not just do you know flag football? He's good. Yeah, he does. He was the second highest Fargo this weekend. We'll be matching up too. Oh, that's cool. Hey, he's out of the Dallas area, right? Yeah. Normally, when he comes out, it's hard. <laughs> Yes. Almost right where it's at, a little bit shorter where it's at. Like that. Oh, but you didn't get back far enough to the eight. Yeah. He called it. So he'll probably just spin the right side and go two rails. If not, just roll up on the eight. I like rolling up on the eight. Three inches rail. Make him kick at it. When you do that move first, you have the uh, upper hand. You have to react to what right on top of the ball, they're almost have to fill out. Or leave you a keep it there. I'll roll up on it. Get a row, roll up on it. Gotta get behind that nine. Perfect. Nice. Uh, it's such an ugly shot here. 
it's such a, it's such a bad spot. It's like the perfect safe. You can't hit any side of the ball and it's that distance. Yeah. Two balls on the table. Even if you jump at it, you're gonna leave yeah, it wide open. And then you're behind on the score. Just such a hit. You almost have to jump bank and I think try to get it over there by the break cross. Draw the ball back to the bottom rail. I think so he's getting his jump. Yeah, like a little touch of right spin. Hopefully the eight ball goes by the break cross. Yep, he's calling the jump bank. Like you called yeah, it. A little touch of right spin. Draw that ball. Oh, no, right. Got away with it. You know who you play next? I don't. Or are you one of those that don't pay attention to the bracket? Yeah, I'm one of those. I like to be surprised. <laughs> like, hey, I'm playing Efren, all right. Hey! <laughs> To see. Yeah. Not the best way. yeah, the angle where I got the camera is not. It's not like if you're playing yourself. Right, playing right, yourself. Right. So players always have a better view of the table. But y'all can watch Albert rack it. I'll make sure to switch it back. Shows that the nine is on the spot. Believe it or not, the table is pretty close. Oh, the other ones are a little bit fast. The rails are live, but the inside of the clock is a little slow. Okay. The ones on Embassy uh, for the Lone Star Tour, those are, those are all sweet. They're all brand new. Yeah. These are already broken. A little bit slower than normal. They're playing good, though. It seems like the cross is a little bit happier. Like that. Here or? Here. Here? Well, they normally use Simona. 860, I think. But I'm not sure what they have got. were able to get. I, mean, I think Simona's is catching up when their factory got flooded, but... I don't That's know right. if they're still. I noticed a lot of tables are a little bit. They have. I think it's called the Mono 868R. HR. High resolution. But it's a little bit nappier. That uh, the threads when they're playing. Intertwine. Yeah. They seem a little bit bigger. It's not like a, a thread count for a silk sheet. So right, right, right. Higher right. count where it's right. real thin, real, real tight. Fine. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Twelve hundred, yeah. She'll be out here. Might as well be playing like two rounds. Yeah, I don't know. Still cuttable though. Oh, yeah, that's way up there. No one has to put the cue ball right in the middle. Of the table, cut the pitch back and put that right. If you want to block it. Fixes by the hole, though, it looks a little bit yeah, it's further, but. He looked like he was trying to look where to spot it. Yeah. Eight. Nice. Oh, yeah, he was trying to go for the position. Low right and going three rows. First row where it's at, second yeah. row up there, and then last row bottom. Then. Like a little bit. Like a little bit. Everybody plays it. I like oh, yeah. that in my stroke out. 
Yeah, well, sometimes when you try to hold it, it it hurts you more than anything. Sometimes you let it go. This crack. Uh, it's gonna be in the pocket. I think I got lucky here. Just keep on. Nice. All right. Clint has to go to nine. And Albert to eight. What is that? Uh, like seven oh seven, seven oh five. That's one of my goals. It's weird because I was at 689 and I wanted to be there. Yeah, well, it also depends on who you play. If you uh, played a lot of players at lower skill levels and they were close, yours is going to be coming down. Yeah, if you weren't blowing them out. But yeah. you also you also have to think Poison Tour does not report. They do oh, paper yeah. brackets for everything, so those won't affect you at all. Now, Syntex will report. They do with digital four. I beat Andy Jetwa and Mazaro. They have like their stuff. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah. Was yeah, it's one of those things. Let's see. I know, because I was like, I have 11 points to break 700. No, Rudy didn't travel to Nashville last weekend. There's a, a poison tour stop that was here. You're you've got a naturally soft voice, so it gets you a little bit. He's adjusting his mic, everybody. I'm just going to eat the mic. Eat the mic. <laughs> <laughs> Camera's off center. Refresh your screen, Russell. I think I'm going to go try the uh, Skinny Bob Classic. Oh, the Nine Ball Classic? Yeah, Lisa yeah. and I will go up there Saturday. we got to get stuff together. I don't know how long we'll be there, but we are coming up for at least Saturday. It's going to be a good tournament. Oh, yeah. That's always going to be a good one. I think... Uh, All the top players, right? Yeah, but I think, what, Alex Pagaline's coming down. Or I'll so. take 13-5. <laughs> Bad. He probably would give it to me, too. Yeah. I like it. Try it. Uh, you still got to win. Yeah. yeah, I don't know who else is going to show up. There's just so many big tournaments going on lately. And then you got the, everything that's a match room for match room points. Oh, yeah. You know, the bigger players are trying to hit, make sure they hit those. That way they can get the points. Billy Thorpe won the uh, Bayou Yeah, they in the final. You know, I was watching a little bit of a stream uh, with Fetters when Collins was uh, commentating for his. Have you ever played one ball, one pocket? Uh, last night for last four thousand <laughs> for one ball for four thousand. I had never seen it before. Four ball, four thousand dollar ball. And then check this out. I had a ball roll off. Oh, the ball rolled off. Ended up going to. Where it goes. Yeah. But uh, I like. I like one ball, one pocket. Just the moving. Yeah, 
That's exactly what I was watching him do it. Like, because I watched uh, Fetter play Tony Chohan. You know what I've been? Uh, well, not that I've been playing, but I play when I get a chance to golf. Buddy Roland, such a good game. And what's that involved? It's two balls. You have one. I have one. You gotta make it in the middle pocket first. Go around the table all the way, so they're like holes. Oh, okay. And you, you can bet whatever you want, five a hole, and then the foul is five or a dollar, whatever. Oh, okay. So it's pretty interesting. Guys are quick. It basically means you need to make sure you got some money on it. Yeah, he, you gotta know how to move too. Very intricate game. You gotta know when to take fouls and getting out of that side pocket. Is I'm down this big. I can try to free stroke. Forget about anything. Really just try to win balls and bear down. Yeah. And let my stroke out. What and else do you have to lose? And just wherever you end up, you end up. Yeah, I just try to hit something out of the air, hopefully get some rolls, maybe a couple dry breaks, and then get back in the bag. A touch of inside, one rail. Nice. Right there for the six. Might be it. Alright, Albert just could tease it. Alright. 